Ladies and gentlemen, it is 6 a.m. and a gray day in New York City, but luckily for you, you're watching the CalvoCast. Joining me today is the one, the only, the terrifying, the deadly, the amazing Spider-Man. No formalities, Mr. Bo. Call me Spidey. Sorry, sir. <laughs> Sorry, sir. Asshole. Oh, Now you know how happy I can be Oh, and a good time starts and ends Without a love one to spend But how much, baby, do you He tells me he was going to be Mr. Coffee. Mr. Coffee? I hate him. Hey, Mr. Coffee, how about you come my way? I could really use a sick latte right now. Oh, this suit? Nah, it's just one I made for a rainy day, you know? Thicker materials. Is it waterproof? Uh, no. No, it's not. More just a cold day suit. Basically, yeah. Why not call it a thermal suit? Because it's not thermal. This early is an absolute crime. I mean, what is it, like 7.45? Yep, still no bus. Cybercrime's a bit of a different story. Sure. Alright, so, I'm not great at speeches, but I have some things I want to say to the people out there listening. Sometimes you won't always have the chance to be fully ready to face something, and that's okay. You don't have to be completely on top of it all to do the right thing. All anyone can ever ask of you is your best. Just stay true to yourself and be marvelous. <laughs> I'm literally crying right now. Aw, does someone need a hug? <sighs> hey, what's up, big boy? Hey, dude, have you heard about the seminar? No, what about it? It's canceled, dude. Really? You didn't get the notification? No, I didn't. Oh, well, it's canceled. Yeah, well, I came, I was waiting for nothing. Man. Hey, you, you want to hang out? 
That's why you dick about Hey, 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 let's do off with a pursuit. Um, I'm here on business. Do you have a permit? Yeah, hold on. He's your permit. NYU security switchboard, how can we help? Evacuate the campus immediately. Nox has attacked me. I don't know if there are. Okay, I'm going to need you to stay calm. We'll start initiating the security protocol. And while we do that, sir, I'm going to need you to go to the safe zone. On tonight's episode of New York Underworld, we'll be interviewing the Chameleon, the most deceptive enemy of New York City. Touch me again, and I will annihilate you. <laughs> Tracy, where are you? H264. Why? You gotta get out of there. Can you not hear the alarm? Very funny. I'm just trying to work on my essay right now, so, okay? No, you gotta get out of there now. Yeah, you're very funny. It's not a prank. It's, it's not funny. Tracy? Tracy? Need to tell me you gave a random kid your location? I'm sticking to my script, you stick to yours. For what? Freaking Ox, always a maverick. I think stuff like this is why they will not let you join the Sinister Six. I could think of a few more reasons. Oh, not you again! Oh, you've been working out. This is kind of romantic. I never thought I'd say this, but it's offensive that there are no gunmen here. See ya. Just kidding, put him up. Yoink! Ox, you should know better than to leave your phone open with me around. I'm just gonna flood your camera roll with selfies. So, who are you working for? Chameleon has the data of every student in this college as we speak, and now he has a hostage. Did you seriously just blow cover? Oh, hey, Chameleon, looking good. Wanna get Taco Bell? Ah, oh, shut up. I'm just trying to ask you on a date. No need to be rude. Alright, this is it. Now or never. What the hell is he doing? Tracy, what the hell? Can you not hear the alarms? Okay, I'm just saving my work now. I'll be right out. Tracy, what the hell is wrong with you? Go on, run ahead. Flee. I'll be right with you. Tracy, seriously. Touch me again and I will annihilate you. I know that voice. Yeah. And now he's screwed. You've pushed your luck, kid. End of the line. You make headlines. Oh. Uh, knock knock. Yeah, it's me. Um, can I come in? Don't you have somewhere else to be, Spider-Man? My work's not done here yet. Sorry. You are a special kind of crazy doing what you did in there. Well, I didn't know if my sister was safe. But how did you know your fake sister was the chameleon? I recognized the voice from those crime watch documentaries. Oh, so you didn't go out of the way just to smack your sister over the head with a laptop. Well, there was never any doubt. As soon as she started threatening me, I knew. Well, that's really nice to know. Well, thank God. I couldn't live with myself if I knocked her out. 
I, I'm gonna head out. Except, voila! Tracy's phone. Thanks, Spider-Man. So formal. Just call me Spidey. Take it easy, homie. Uh, hello again, dickwad. Excuse me? Tracy? Hey, yeah, sorry, I let her use my phone. Why do you call your friend dickwad? Oh, nothing, it's stupid. Are you okay? Yeah, I, I got out of there as fast as I could. Do you have my phone? Boy, do I have a story for you. But yeah, I do. Alright, so, I'm not great at speeches, but I have some things I want to say to the people out there listening. Sometimes you won't always have the chance to be fully ready to face something, and that's okay. You don't have to be completely on top of it all to do the right thing. All anyone can ever ask of you is your best. Just stay true to yourself and be marvelous. Do I?